Today we're here to uh, discuss the Phoenix 3 meter and motor. The motor itself is locked in by our three locking tabs. Very quickly, you can release a locking tab, turn the motor sideways, back the motor out, and the motor comes completely away. It uh, is larger for one thing. The motor itself is external of the housing. We have a large uh, keyed shaft here, keyed on both sides. So when it mates up to the roller, it's gonna have positive force on both sides of that roller as it's uh, metering out through the field. As you can see with the roller itself, it is made of a nice flexible material. If there's any large chunks of material in the tank, foreign objects that it needs to try to put through, these fins can bend over and allow that material to still go past without, uh, without jamming the roller. Once you're inside the meter, the flow that this product is gonna come out of the meter at, along with our, our flutes being offset so that it's not just one large flute dumping into the airstream at a time, it is a, similar to a V shape on the bottom of that to allow consistent product flow coming off of this meter as opposed to just dumping of the product off this meter. It's gonna go ahead and allow us to comfortably meter out a wide range of products, anything from very low rates to ultra high rates, and in terms of the consistency of that product, all the way along from a very coarse, uh, heavy abrasive material to something maybe a little bit lighter and uh, allow us to successfully meter that out. We can go ahead and stick this back together very quickly, get ourselves up and running, hop into the tractor and do what's important and that's get seed in the ground. Mm -hmm.